I thought about becoming a doctor for a couple of reasons. Although my dad did not graduate from high school, he taught both me and my brother the value of education. You're gonna to go to college. You're gonna have a better life than your mother and I do. I learned by example that there's a lot of reward in helping someone else have it better than you do. It's an honor to say I grew up downriver and that I take care of people who also call downriver their home. What I love most about being a doctor is knowing that you made a difference in someone's life and that they had enough confidence and respect for you that they've given you the privilege of doing that. Dr. Lomansky has a lot of really key critical roles as a part of Henry Ford Wyandotte. When he walks into the room, he has a very warm, um, calming effect. One of the major things he will stand out for is being able to integrate Riverside into Wyandotte, really forming Henry Ford Wyandotte Hospital. One of the critical things that he'll always get you know, credit and be reminded for is having our teaching hospital status be what it is. He has a good sense of humor. I think that's a wonderful quality, but also very dependable. I mean, Dr. Lemansky really deeply cares, and his just deep commitment to medical education is something that we really focused on that is a main differentiator. I've known Dr. Lemansky for about 25 years. He's been a teacher, a coach, a mentor. I attribute my professional success and who I am today as a doctor because of the influences that Dr. Lemansky has had on me both personally and professionally. Dr. Lemansky has been both locally and nationally a leader in osteopathic medical education dating back to the early 1980s. I am the physician that I am today because of Dr. Lemansky. He actually saved my life at Riverside, so I owe a lot of dedication to that man for being there for me. When my daughter passed away, and he was there for me from day one, so he's just been an inspiration to me to keep on going. He's just a wonderful person to work with. He's a joy, a pleasure. He's a mentor. I've known Dr. Lemansky for over 25 years. I've worked at Riverside Osteopathic Hospital with him, and he was my boss. He's just very down to earth, asking you the right questions, and he makes you feel like you're very important no matter what the issue is. You can just see he loves being a doctor. He's got that twinkle in his eye, and he's very, very good at it, but you can tell that that's his love. He loves being a physician. I am Dr. Lemansky's daughter. What I admire most about my dad is how humble he is. It's hard to find people in the world that don't want the spotlight on them, and that's him, definitely. He loves his family, he loves his community, and he loves his hospital. He treats everybody with dignity, class, and respect. And from when I was young, that's what he always taught us as well. I chose to nominate my dad because I've seen his dedication to service for others. He is a pillar in the community. I think he's very deserving of the award. I would like to say congratulations, Dr. Lemansky, on being a Cahalan Award winner. I think it's long overdue, and I'm very proud to be able to be a part of thanking you. Nothing means more to me than the respect of my family. For my daughter to say, Dad, I nominated you I couldn't turn down the nomination this time. Trisha, I can't thank you enough. And it means the world to me.